Another interesting tool in 3D is zipper for make a zipper in, uh, for example, in this part, front part of your pattern. As you can see, this part is closed and we have to open it. Go into the edit string and click on this <clears throat> string part and delete it. And I have to uh, cut this part. So for doing this, uh, first, I want to draw a line here. For doing that, first I remove uh, linked editing. It's a one piece because if you draw something, it's exactly the right twice. Go select this part if you want and right click. And I have to, I think I cut it. Uh, for doing that, I can first delete that line. I don't need that. And create my own internal line from here to the here. Okay. Going to the edit, the right click. And now you can cut it. And simulate. And now you can see we have this part cut. And I want to uh, connect to this part with a zipper tool. It's very simple and easy. Click zipper tool. You can do it in a 2D. Uh, select one part. Uh, for better understanding the <clears throat> path for software, click in a way. Click, click to understand it this way better. Okay. As you can see, I think we have a problem here. If you have problems something like this, zoom in to the software and for the first pass you double click to finish <clears throat> first pass is understand and going to the second pass for better understanding software you zoom in select it to understand it okay click click in a way that software understand the pass better <clears throat> and done double click and waiting for software to think and it's done as you can see the zipper add here simulate and it's very interesting done here this is our zipper as you can see that's the texture and everything here for for example if you want to open it go to the select tool select this if you select it as you can see in properties you can change the slider and the puller shape and its properties. Like uh, I will explain it. Going mouse over, in, if you the mouse is in a, this shape, you can click and drag it, as you can see, and release it, <clears throat> and simulate again. It will be open here. Interesting. Okay, and turn the simulation off. Uh, if you select the uh, zipper main uh, body its uh, properties will be changed first we select we <clears throat> begin with that uh, here you can change you can see the uh, line line length in a centimeter here you can change the size of the line as you can see you can make it bigger for refreshing you have to um, uh, simulate it here you can change the t's width these are t's or total width you can change it you can change the thickness for making better 3d simulate the thickness you can change the thickness here for example look. as you can see we have a uh, more thickness <clears throat> The particle distance, this is uh, act <clears throat> exactly like a fabric. As you can see, we have a facet here. For better forming that, you can uh, change the particle distance to the smaller number. As you can see, we have better stimulation for the zipper. Fasten the zipper, it means it's automatically fastened. You can uncheck that to it's, the, it's open. You can fasten it again and done. 
uh, here is a fold uh, angle don't change that this is the fold angle uh, to connecting this part to the main body of the uh, zipper don't change that it's nice sometimes you need to, for example uh, as you can see if you simulate we need more fold angle here if you change it as you can see it's not folding it's folding but we don't need to fold it this angle and make it to the uh, 180 degree it means it's flat it's connecting flat to the main body of the pattern and interesting part is uh, here sorry i change suffer <clears throat> here you can change the material here you can change the main body to the for example the metal as you can see you can change it to the metal or plastic or any type that you want okay uh, <clears throat> here you can change the texture if you click it as you can see this is a texture with a normal map that you can uh, <clears throat> it looks like it's 3d you can give any texture here uh, I for example give another texture here uh, navigate to my folder here I have a pack for zipper a two side for example this you can open it and now it will be changed here you can change it to the mat if you want and done and because we changed the sorry selected we change the texture here you have to delete the normal map for this because we need the specific normal map for that or displacement map you can change the overall color opacity and reflection and uh, here you can change the custom physical properties for this part as you can see this is separate the separate part with a different uh, properties here you can add a lot of properties in the fabric uh, it's it does not change to the cotton but the physical properties of the cotton uh, give to the this and the cotton heavy as you can see change as you can see it's more heavy and dense change and uh, that's it if you want you can change the detail as i said before another uh, setting is if you select the, the puller here you can change it as you can see you can change the puller just a little select it to make it better if you select the puller here you can change its properties from here as you can see <clears throat> click on this uh, icon and you can change the puller shape in any shape that you want or uh, a slider or a puller as you can see you can change any puller that you want interesting and of course we have a stopper at the top and at the end it's so a stopper you can change the stopper at the top and stopper at the button okay stopper this is stopper top and stopper at the button you can change it <clears throat> and uh, in a gauge you can change the size of its this slider and puller an interesting part is weight if you turn on the simulation sorry control z to back if i turn on the simulation and if you select it and as you can see here you can change the real weight of it for example a heavy weight as you can see it pulls down because it's more heavier <laughs> So you can change the head in a gram. You can change the weight, weight here. It's very simple. And as you can see, it's more lighter. 
and here you can change the fasten you can open it if you want it's open or fasten again here you can reverse the zip direction it's on it's going in this direction and you can move the opposite side uh, as you can uh, in a real world as you can see the this puller and slider is connected into the one side you can change the side for example if it's in the, this side you can change to the other side move to the other side if you, if you want to close it again you can uh, select it and click and drag i think you have oh, we have to turn the simulation off select it you have to uh, make sure the mouse if you're going a mouse over that the uh, shape of a mouse is like this and it's gray out and you can click and drag it to the up and it's connecting the up okay select it again <clears throat> And here you can change the material for example you can uh, change it to the metal if you want okay change it to metal and any material that you want you can give a texture normal map or any that you want and that's it i explained it before in uh, this software the material tab uh, is the same you can change the material of the slider material of the puller but it is used the same material as a slider. If it is on, uh, any setting that you set here will be given to the disk tab and given to the stopper. But if you want to give a different properties, for example, for a puller, you can turn it off and change the type to matte, for example, or matte with a different color that you want, you can select it and okay, okay. If you want to use the same material as a slider, you can turn it on again. And okay, it's a zipper. It's very simple and straightforward and you can use it in your project. So here we can change its properties, thickness or t suites line lengths. Okay, that's very easy. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.